I realize if my health is going to be great, it's going to be left up to me. I detox every morning. And I use beets, garlic, carrots, celery, apples, and a lemon. The genuine will remove the parasites that stuck to your gut. You know how you go to the gym and you can lose everything. But that gut don't go nowhere. Those are parasites that stuck to your gut from eating processed food, fried food, the skin off the chicken, even if it's baked. And we must change our diet. And those Roman noodles that you've been feeding your babies, one package has 25 grams of salt. You see, the doctor ain't going to tell you how to eat right or how to prevent cancer from entering your body. It is time that we, as a race of people, that we learn up and we read up about our own health. Because if you think any doctor care, you let me meet that doctor. It's about profit from health care. That's all they are concerned about. Every time you go to the doctor, they'll give you a pill after a pill after another pill. And all those pills do is cause you to be a walking medicine cabinet. And I say today, black people, we must not be stereotyped. We can give obesity back one pound at a time. And most of our sickness, if the doctor didn't do it to us, it was self-inflicted. And I want to see my people healthier so we can keep going to the polls and changing the world like we did this past midterm election. You must fight for your own health because the doctors don't give no fuck in Chicago. Illinois, Northwestern and Rush have given me nightmares talking about I got blood cancer diagnosed with it on February the 13th and I told them that I drink this every day. Oh, they got that bad white blood count and they ran with it. Talking about blood cancer and when they knew I didn't have it. I wish like hell I would have laid down on a table and did a bone marrow biopsy that I didn't need. And finally, since February the 14th, it took until November the 8th because he left a paper trail in my chart. Every time I went to a new doctor, we need to order some more blood work. You got blood cancer. I say, if I got blood cancer, and it make a 60-year-old woman feel this good. I don't have a pain from the top of my head until the bottom of my feet. Yes, I itch a lot, and I'm anemic. But I know damn well, and they did too. I didn't have blood cancer Northwestern. And Veronica Johnson, I was told she no longer worked for Northwestern Medicine in Chicago giving me that bare-faced lie done sent the hospital nurse getting ready to send me a hospital bed. I don't have cancer. I got Jesus. 